Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Way Cooking. Today I'm going to be cooking some oxtail and bean for you, of course. In the pot we have the oxtail right now, it's already washed, it's ready to be seasoned right now. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to take you over to the seasoning area. I'm going to be adding the onions. Uh, we have it there, we have the scallions right there beside the onions. We have the thyme and I also have this garlic. I also have some uh, pimentas, which is going to give it some allspice. It's going to give it a nice flavor as we move on. We have the black pepper also that is very important to the whole um, seasoning process. We have the soya sauce. Um, this is a very good one. You can choose one that you like. And I also am going to be using some oxtail seasoning just to create more flavor to the pot. All right, so I want you to observe the seasoning. These are very easy. Add the onion to the pot. Afterwards, you can always um, add the, the scallions as well. Okay, those are the scallions you're going in. Right, um, so you can add, add them whichever way you like. There's no particular order in which you have to add them. Okay, um, I'm adding right now some garlic um, to the pot because um, I mentioned that garlic gives it a nice flavor, guys. It's gonna lock in the taste, it's gonna make it nice. Okay, and um, of course, I'm adding on right now the allspice. In Jamaica, we call it the pimento, right? But it's really allspice that we're using. We have the black pepper we're adding to the pot right now. Okay, isn't that beautiful? Look at the color and everything that, you know, how beautiful it looks. Everything is coming together in the pot. Time. store is in your area it's not ne necessary to use the oxtail seasoning you can always just use the seasoning um, that I've um, suggested to you before however adding that creates a nice flavor I'm adding some soya sauce to the pot as well which is going to be good for um, flavoring I would suggest that you use only a, 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 a little bit amount of amount not too much okay or add to taste I mean some people like a lot on their oxtail some people don't like a lot on their oxtail Right, for me, I'm putting quite a bit on there because I like the color, I like the flavor of the sauce, right? And I'm going to be stirring um, the pot right now with the seasoning just to get it all mixed into the oxtail. Okay, and um, you know, you take your time and you, you mix it in. Okay. That's what it is. seasoned looking beautiful and everything so what I'm going to be doing now as you can see I'm covering the pot and then I'm gonna put it in the oven okay and I'm gonna allow it to cook for about 15 to 20 30 minutes okay after which I'm gonna take it out and then I'm going to add water to it so what I did I allow it to go into the oven without water just to be sauteed a bit okay to have the season locked into it now I've added water to it right which is going to now bring it all together it's going to now cook because it has to be cooked oxtail guys take a very long time to cook it may take you up to two hours to cook right now it's on uh, it's, it, 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 i've taken out of the oven it's on the stove now i'm doing the finishing of it now this is about an hour and a half hour and 45 minutes okay i'm putting in the beans right now into it and i'm stirring it all together the beans are going to create a nice uh, thick gravy to the pot okay some people use potatoes uh, they cut the potatoes up Irish potatoes use them but I use beans because I like the flavor that the bean gives with the oxtail okay so right there you have it okay it's going to be staying there for the next um, half an hour to 15 minutes and I'm going to allow it right to be cooked into the pot right now you can see it's all done okay and it's falling off the bones that's how you know it's cooked guys when every time you see the meat start falling off the bones that's when you know it is ready look at how beautiful that is that is so tasty guys i'm telling you you guys are going to love this oxtail right here right it, it, it is on the fire it's still hot it's, the pot is bubbly right now right now i have it on top of the stove guys right so i'm finishing it off right now on top of the stove i've taken it out of the oven on top of the stone the stove i have it right now it is so beautiful it is together look at that look guys look 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 at how beautiful that is so tasty right now right beautiful all done all cooked right you guys can try 
try this one at home share it with your friends share this video okay and make sure that you tune in also to the other videos now guys it's all done it's served on the dish what i did i serve it with some white rice okay and also with some um with, with some cucumbers as well I slices of cucumbers fresh nice beautiful oxtail and bean guys well done on the grill please like and subscribe uh, thank you for watching share our videos i'm excited to share my next video with you all right have a good one and